this is Walid from Mr. and Mrs. Vintage Typewriters. Today, today I'm going to show you how to use your Underwood 3-Bank Typewriters. First, when the typewriter arrives, it should be locked. So to unlock it, it's a very simple move. You just push it from the left side to the right side and it will be unlocked. At the end, I'll show you how to lock it. Now I'm going to start with the main options of the typewriter. So. The line spacing lever is on the left side. The line spacing options are 1 and 2 only. It, it can be moved from 1 and 2. Another way to do a line spacing is this way with the pinching. On the right side, there's two, three levers actually. The first lever is the carriage return lever on here. You press it down, keep holding the left side for sure, and your carriage is released. The paper release lever on this side, it will help you to insert your paper. So you move it towards you, get the paper, you insert here, and then you move it away from you, the paper release lever. And the paper is up. To adjust it, you move it towards you again and you adjust it in any position you want. Then you push it away from you and you are ready to type. So, when you are typing, th that's the end of your line. So, to pass the margin release, there's a margin release re lever on the right side. You reach it, you press it, you will pass your margin and you can continue on typing. Another options we have are the margin setters. These are on opposite sides of the typewriter. And they are on the right side and the left side. As you can see here, this is the right margin that sets the left margin side and the left margin to set the right margin on the carriage. So to set it up, you need to press it down and move it left, left or, or right. Concerning the, uh, the keyboard, the keyboard has usually comes in two caps, but this one is an early version with only one cap uh, key on the left side. This is a capitals, and this is one. This one is for the figure figures. So the capitals, were, if you need to type H, a capital uh, H, you press on the capital and the H, and if you want to type the pound sign, you press on the figures and pound sign at the same time. To lock the options of the caps or figures, use the this uh, this uh, key on here. For the figures, it's this key on here. To set up your colors, there's usually three colors. It's the blue or black, white, and red. The blue is the for the first uh, color select uh, selection. The red is the second color selection, and the stencils in the middle when the ribbon vibrator doesn't move, and it's only used for stencils. So, to reverse your ribbon movement, so if a ribbon is moving from left to right, as you can see, and you need to move it to the other side, here is the lever for reverse ribbon. You just press it to the left or right, and it will go the other way. Mainly these are all the options. Finally, I wanted to show you how to lock the Underwood 3-Bank typewriter. On the left side, you move your typewriter a little bit more to the right side. Put your hand on the mar margin, uh, the carriage release. There's a small hook in here. You raise it up and release the carriage towards the left and it will go into a small hole as you can see and it will be locked in this way your carriage is locked and safe for transit hope this video was helpful 
Thank you for joining us today and please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos on how to use your typewriters.